India, it's uh, Maha Samadhi. In America, it's Groundhog Day. <laughs> it's all the same, strangely enough, it's all the same holiday. It's the exact midwinter point. And Candlemas is also frequently a day that's dedicated to Brigid, or the goddess. Brigid is the goddess of poetry and inspiration and creativity and healing and renewal. And this time of year, even though we're dead in the middle of winter, the days have actually started getting a little longer again. So yay, <laughs> And uh, even though it felt like the dead of winter to me, with all the rain and even thunder and lightning in San Francisco, which is so rare and so exciting and so cold, I'll be darned, today the doves returned to this little space in the light well between our house and the house next door. There's these little perches on the drainage pipes and the doves uh, used them for their nest. So they were kind of condo shopping today, <laughs> looking over which one they wanted. And that, it was like spring. Spring had come. I couldn't believe that the doves were back. So the groundhog, uh, you know, comes out of his little hole and looks to see if he can see his shadow or not. But really, around the world, this day is dedicated to the sacred flame, the feast of the sacred flame. And in that flame, you find purification, renewal, inspiration, healing, guidance, and also perhaps uh, a grant to your wishes or pledges and intentions for the year. This now is sacred time. This now is sacred space. And within this space we bring our powers. Is Guyu Nathraka Ur? Is Guyu Nathrak the Chen? Is Guyu Nathrak Ushka? Is Guyu Nathrak Tala? This is the time of Bridget, the time of Pinoc. To the Druid is the first ritual of spring. It's when, though in midwinter, some plants begin to quicken and flower and come to life. Some wonder if magic is real. When an infant laughs, when the rain falls, when the sun shines, you just can't get better magic than that. And that 